it right out. Perfect, way to go. Let's take a minute and talk about the fact that the anchor tripped and the type of anchor that we have. This is a grapple anchor, which is great for rocks. I even call it my rock anchor because I use it in rocks. And I'm gonna show you, it basically it tripped. So when it was in the water, before we dropped it over, it was not like this. We have our grapple anchor set up with a shackle on the bottom loop, right here. Perfect. And the chain is gonna pull up the anchor then. You're gonna zip tie your chain to your anchor up here, just like that. And that's how we have it rigged when we toss it overboard. See that? Zip tied to the anchor, attached at the bottom with a shackle, and zip tied at the top. Let's talk about what the zip tie does. We have our zip tie on the anchor, and we're gonna pretend that we just threw it in the water, okay? So let's pretend that this anchor is wedged in a rock. Okay, so I'll be right. This is the rock. Perfect. Amanda's daddy's the rock. That's the rock. And we are pulling the anchor. And we're pulling this way, this direction. Okay, guys? We're pulling this way in this direction. And let's say that that rock is so strong, we are not moving the anchor at all. What's going to happen is that tension is actually going to break the zip tie. So let's pretend. So much tension. Oh, my gosh. Zip tie broke. Now what's gonna happen. Now what's gonna happen is this chain is going to come in this direction and we're gonna start pulling the anchor this way. And just like that, your anchor tripped, it's up, it's out of the rock, and you're pulling it this way, out of the seafloor, not digging it deeper. That's why the trip method is really, really, really highly recommended, guys. It's a great way to set up your anchor. If you go to a tackle store, you can ask them to help you set up a rock anchor or a grapple anchor, I should say, with a trip method. They should be able to help you out, tell them what size boat you have, and all that information. But if they can't help you,